Welcome to Outdoor Madness, everyone. I'm your host, Kerry Clark. Is there a place that you enjoy so much that you return to it year after year? A place that when you're leaving, all you can do is think about when you can go back and who you can take with you so you can show them just how how beautiful and how fun this place is well for us here at outdoor madness there are a lot of places like that but today we're going to focus on one place and we've done a few shows on this place before but every time we go back we take somebody new with us and then we want to show you just how much they enjoy it so you in return can make plans to visit this place also well today the place i'm talking about is Felton, California. Felton is a small town located in the Redwoods along Highway 9 and the San Lorenzo River, about six miles north of Santa Cruz in the beautiful Santa Cruz Mountains. Felton was first laid out in 1868 by Edward Stanley. It's debated among historians who the town is named after. Some claim it was Charles Norton Felton, a businessman and civic leader from Yuba County, and others offer evidence it was John Brooks Felton, a lawyer and mayor of Oakland. Well, no matter who the town is named after, it's a gorgeous, beautiful town tucked away in Redwoods, and we're sure that once you visit this place, you will love it. There are so many fun things to do in Felton, California. Do you like to hike? Do you love the Redwoods? Well, we have Henry Cal Redwood State Park where you can hike nice easy trails, beautiful tall redwoods to look at. Then you have Big Basin Redwood State Park where you can get lost, just lost out in all these beautiful tall redwood trees. Now, every time we do a show on Felton, California, there's always one place that stands out to me, and this is a place you have to visit. This place is called Roaring Camp Railroads. Hi, my name is Gary. I work for Roaring Camp. I'm the conductor on this here train. We make an hour and 20 minute round trip to Bear Mountain here. Uh, climbing some of the steepest railway grades in North America and traveling through a magnificent forested canyon, Henry Cow Park, and Roaring Camp especially. Many of the trees here were preserved from loggers way back in the 1860s. 
people that own this land wrote into the deed for their property that there be absolutely no commercial logging of redwoods, perhaps the very first groves of ancient trees to preserve in such a fashion. Pulling our train is an historic Shea gear driven locomotive. This particular locomotive is our very first locomotive that uh, pulled trains up to Bear Mountain here over a half a century ago. Hope you enjoy the rest of your stay here at Roaring Camp and have an absolutely fantastic rest of this Wednesday afternoon. Can we go in the tree? <laughs>
There is another thing I love about Felton. Monterey Bay, Fisherman's Wharf, the Aquarium, Big Sur, Carmel Valley. All of these destinations are within a short driving distance from Felton. So what we like to do is, we like to grab an Airbnb big enough to accommodate just as many people as we have. Of course, we split the price and you save so much money. And who doesn't like to save money? There is a place that you return to year after year, isn't there? Well, continue to do that and take as many people as you can with you so that they can experience that great feeling that you get when you visit your special place. And when you get the chance, go to Felton, California, experience Roaring Camp Railroad, Henry Cowell Redwood State Park, Big Basin Redwood State Park. I promise you, these destinations will put a smile on your face. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. I'm Kerry Clark for Outdoor Madness. And you know what? I will see you somewhere in the great outdoors. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!